What's going on, Body Bags? Andrew here, back at you another video. And I watched this movie last night, so I was wanting to do a review for it, just because I thought it was pretty, uh, looked pretty interesting, and um, heard heard some fun things about it. So yeah, Mayhem. This is from last year. I did not get to this one uh, in 2017, uh, it w so it wasn't eligible and will not be eligible for a list this year. Um, these these premises don't really interest me whatsoever. Um, but yeah, this basically takes place in a uh, corporate building, and uh, Stephen Young, uh, Glenn from The Walking Dead, he is he plays a man by the name of Derek Cho, and he um, is you know on the rise in this corporate world, and he just gets fired um, by some bullshit reasoning one day. And basically, that's about, that's, uh, from there, there's this, like, zombie outbreak. It, well, it's not zombies, but it's, like, it turns people into, like, rabid animals, almost. Like, all of their negative functions are heightened. So, basically, all their aggression, all their sexuality, like, all of that stuff is micro, uh, it, or maximized. So, like, you know, people are just, you know, going crazy. Um, and, and this, uh, office gets quarantined. So, basically... Him and Samara Weaving, whom we meet, is uh, getting screwed over by the company that Stephen Young works for. Um, they join forces to take care of all of the uh, corporate uh, office uh, people. So, yeah, basically, um, this is uh, whatever that other movie... Honestly, I can't even remember the name of that one movie from last... Same thing. That one was a theatrical release. This one was a direct-to-video. Um... For what, for how forgettable every single character was in that movie, and just forgettable that movie was, this one takes the same premise, which again, I'm not a big fan of, and um, just has fun with it. So you know what, I'm not going to go back to this movie for probably five years from now, but it's fun for what it is. It's it's an enjoyable time. Um, I had a lot more fun with that movie than, than, or this movie than whatever that other movie was. Like, still, I honestly can't remember it. Um, yeah, it's, it's really well shot. I hate every single other Joe Lynch movie. Uh, like, Wrong Turn 2, I absolutely hate. That's my least favorite, or second least favorite in the whole series of the Wrong Turn franchise. Um, yeah, it's well acted. It's a bit over the top, uh, which is done on purpose. So, it's, I, I enjoy it for that. And, um, yeah, I thought a couple things were a little bit, um, it betrayed a couple plot points. For example, um, Stephen Young and Samara Weaving's, like, they have a sex scene, um, and it's very tame, and kind of the whole point of the whole virus is, like, that it's, you know, making everybody go crazy and do things to, like, the exponential than what they normally would do. All of their functions are lost, and... To me, it, it kind of didn't make sense. There's a couple other times that it does it, but that's the one that, that stuck out most to me. Um, so yeah, there's a couple issues that I had with it, and just the general premise of it in general. I, I hate corporate office buildings. They're just boring to me. Different than a high-rise building. That's a living community and uh, a little bit different, or I like when people live in it. Uh, this is just kind of boring. and um, But again, they make the most of it. I'm still not going to come in too high, but I'm going to come in 7.75 out of 10. It's a really solid flick. Um, yeah. All right, that's going to do it for today, guys. I'll see you next week with another random review. Peace.